It's now 11 p.m. on Friday, the 30th of November. The negotiations are still going on as we left the um, COP venue, and they'll probably go on well past midnight. People are, the negotiators are trying to negotiate and finish some of the text by tomorrow before the ministers arrive on Sunday. Uh, otherwise, the ministers will have to take charge and resolve all the un outstanding issues after they arrive uh, from Monday onwards. So I won't report on the negotiation status now because we don't know what's happening. Uh, what I will do is report on a side event that we just completed this evening, <coughs> which was a joint side event by IIED and the government of the Gambia, which happens to also to be the chair of the LDC group. And it was about how LDCs are actually going forward with adaptation at the national level, a variety of different experiences from Bangladesh, uh, particularly on how it's incorporated in planning, uh, a review of the pilot project on climate resilience of the World Bank, PPCR, carried out by a colleague of mine, Neha Rai, from IIED, and also uh, remarks from the government of Nepal, Mr. Thapa, and from the government of Bangladesh, uh, Dr. Manjurul Hannan Khan and it was chaired by Paul Smanch Jarju, uh, the LDC chair from the Gambia. Despite the fact that we had a very late night slot, it, the, the side event was from 8 to 10 p.m., we still had a very good turnout of over about 40 people in the room, a lot of very good questions and discussions, which is testimony to the fact that adaptation has now risen up the agenda, there's a lot of interest, and there's a lot more interest in practice of adaptation rather than just the negotiations on adaptation and uh, this side event was a very good demonstration. Tomorrow and day after, Saturday, Sunday, which is the middle weekend of the, the two-week COP, uh, I will be reporting back from the Development and Climate Days event, which this year is being primarily organized by the Red Cross Climate Change Center and also with the Global Environment Facility who are doing an Adaptation Practitioners Day within that, uh, together with IIED as well, although IIED is taking a back seat this year. Um, we hope to have a lot more presentations of practical experiences on the Jeff event and also some very interesting, innovative uh, actions and activities with the Red Cross event, and I'll report back on them over the course of the next two days.